Hi there, my name is Lisa Middleton. I'm a sports dietitian and I'm here today talking about healthy eating. Hey, I'm Cam Glidden. I'm the shooting guard for the Southeast Melbourne Phoenix and happy to be here to, to learn a bit. So for athletes, it's really important for them to fuel their bodies well for training and games. It's not just fueling your muscles and your, your body to work well, it's also the effect of fuel and what you eat on your brain. So um, things like concentration, focus, judgment, coordination, all those things are really important, especially for basketball. So making sure the fuel and the foods that you're eating are fueling your brain function as well as fueling your body to, to get to the end of the game still performing well. So Cam, when it comes to fueling, when we're thinking on game day, do you have any sort of routines that you have before games or at half time to sort of keep your energy levels up and your focus up until the end of the game? I eat the, the main pre-game meal about two hours before, just so it's in and it's um, settled and, and I'm ready to run around. But definitely at half time, it's really important for me to get a bit more in and kind of refocus and, and get back into it. So I like to eat a banana at half time and usually a sandwich. And just so I feel just mentally, I feel ready to go again for the next 20 minutes. And one thing we've been talking about, Cam, is fish, isn't it? We've been talking about the importance of fish for protein, but also for omega-3 fats, which are really good for inflammation, helping to reduce inflammation. So um, so you've been trying to get a bit more fish in? Yeah, I obviously, um, I don't really like to cook it at home. I don't trust myself. Um, so I have it when I go out to restaurants and that. So once a week, I'll try to get that in. But the tuna cans come in really handy for me. I bring them in uh, for post sessions just to get that in real quick. and. And, and a handful of nuts as well, just to, just to keep me going for the weight sessions. So fish is a great source of protein, but we can also um, look at other things. So we've got dairy here, dairy is a good source of protein. Your nuts down the front, they give you a little bit of protein as well. And eggs, of course, eggs are great for protein, as well as the more typical um, meat and chicken, and athletes tend to eat a lot of chicken in general, so um, it's a favorite. Yeah, for me being kind of a, a thinner, leaner guy, um, my goal is always just to get as much in as possible and uh, not stick to like your three meals a day, but try to get a lot of little meals in between. So this is real perfect for me. I eat a lot of this stuff, a lot of yogurt, tuna, nuts, eggs in the morning. Yeah, I definitely perform on my best when my diet's in order. Um, I've had times where I've been injured, um, had back injuries, and, and usually your diet goes out the window when you can't really get up and walk. Um, lose some weight, lose some muscle, and um, that's when some bad things can happen. So when my diet's at its best and I'm um, eating what I should be eating and um, lifting what I should be lifting, um, I can definitely perform on the court better and, and stay injury free for longer. And yeah, keep going as hard as I can for the 40 minutes because um, it's, it's a huge part of the game, staying on the court for as long as you can and um, keep my nutrition at its best. If you're wanting to improve your nutrition, it's really important to think about just some of the basic steps and the simple things that you can do. You don't need to overhaul everything at once. Even just like we were talking about um, with vegetables and fruits and those fresh foods, eating less processed foods, making sure you're having some good quality protein sources. So we're talking about fish and dairy, lean meats, nuts and seeds, legumes, those sorts of things. And trying to incorporate those into your normal, regular routine. Yeah, being, having a good diet helps my life outside of basketball, just keeping healthy. Uh, I'm a dad now, so uh, making sure I spend quality time with my daughter and I'm teaching her the right things and, and giving her the right things to eat as well. So there's no stock in the fridge with the wrong thing because it will end up in her mouth. So uh, making sure I'm eating the right things and, and setting a good example at home um, is important to me.